welcome to this channel i'm mr wadetto i'm a mathematics teacher and uh, i'd like to take you through uh, a formal topic known as linear equation and i'm going to deal with simultaneous equation so uh, what is simultaneous equation this is a linear equation with two unknown we have various ways of solving simultaneous equation about four of them one being elimination method number two being substitution method number three graphic method and then number four being matrix method but uh, in my case i would like to start with the elimination method uh, we see how do we go about solving simultaneous equation using the elimination method now elimination method what you're going to be doing is you are going to get rid of one unknown that's why we are talking about eliminating uh, or the elimination method and to start with uh, let me have uh, a first example so that i can be able to uh, show you how do we go about the uh, elimination method and we come to solving uh, the uh, simultaneous equation my first example is going to, going to be x plus y is equals to 8 and then x minus y is equals to 4 So this is a simultaneous equation uh, which we need to be uh, solved. We need to get the values of x and the y using the elimination uh, method. Now, uh, we need to get rid of x or y. That's basic, uh, basically what you require to get. So if I want to get rid of uh, x, what am I going to do? I can subtract the two equations. I uh, can subtract the two equations so that I can have x minus x is 0 uh, it has been eliminated or in other words it has disappeared now uh, so x minus x 0 then y minus minus y that one is going to be y plus 1 because minus 4 by minus is plus so I'm going to be having 2y then 8 minus 4 is 4 so uh, 2 is equal to 4 so what is y? 2 so I have gotten the value of uh, y is 2 then I can use one of the equation either equation 1 or 2 to get the value of x so I have I can take the first one x plus y is equal to 8 uh, my y is 2 here so x plus 2 is equal to 8 so what is going to be x x would be i take two on the other side eight minus two which is equal to six so my value of x is six and the y is two i have solved the simultaneous equation and when you get those values you can try and see whether you have done the right thing like now i can use the equation two x minus y is equal to four i want to check whether my answers are right all so x is 6 minus y is 2 6 minus 2 give me 4 meaning my working is correct so this is a bit thing about uh, simultaneous equation you can be able to get to see whether you can mark for yourself and see that uh, you have done the right thing very simple and a very nice uh, method. Let's uh, look at uh, example two. We see uh, what we can be able to have. Example two. Two m plus n is equals to 7 3m 
minus 2n is equal to 10. So this is another kind of a simultaneous equation and you want to solve it using the elimination method. So the first thing here we do is to decide uh, what do you want to eliminate. Is it m or n? So let's assume or let's eliminate m. For us to eliminate m, we need to have the values of m be equal to. Then you can be able to see that uh, first m is 2, the other one is 3. We make them the same. So how do we go about that? We just get the same of 2 at the 3, which is 6, so that you can be able to make them 6, both of them. For us to make them 6, the first equation I multiply by 3, and this one I multiply by 2, so that I can have uh, 3 times 2, 6m, uh, plus 3 times 10, 3n equals to 3 times 7, 21, and 2 times 3, 6m, uh, minus 2 times 2, 4n is equals to 2 times 20, uh, times 2, you get 20. Now, my m are uh, equal to one another, so I can be born out to, uh, uh, to get rid of m. So I because they have the same sign, they discuss for us here, I subtract the two equations. Like, so I can have 6 minus 6, 0. So we have eliminated m. Then we have 3n minus minus 4n. A minus 4 by minus is plus. So this is 3 uh, plus 4, you get 7. n is equals to 21 minus 20, which is equals to 1. So my n is going to be 1 over 7. You divide both sides by 7. So when you get the value of, of n as that, you, 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 you take one equation there, uh, like equation 1 or 2, whichever case. Uh, let's take equation 1. 2m plus n is equal to 7. So 2m, I now replace uh, n with 1 over 7. Uh, is equals to 7 here. Yeah. So I'm going to be having now 2m is equals to 7. Uh, I take it on the other side, minus 1 over 7. So the OCM there is 7. 7 divided by 1, 7 times 9, 49. Minus 7 divided by 7, 1 times 1, 1. So this is 48 over 7. So that is 2m is 48 over 7. I divide by 2. I divide by 2. Or otherwise, I multiply by half. The same thing. So I get by 2 and by 2, 24. So my m is 24 over 7. So m, n is 1 over 7. n, uh, m is uh, 24 over 7. And you can able to check whether your work is correct by replacing one of your work with the values of m at the end just to get to see whether you have done the right thing so we can use the second equation here uh, 6m minus 4n is equals to uh, 20 and let's see the, the, the one that we have not yet multiplied by 2 uh, the very m minus 2n is equals to 10. What is m? 24 over 7. So 3 times 24 over 7 minus 2 times 1 over 7. You see, uh, it's going to give us 10. So 3 times 24, that one is uh, 72 uh, over 7 minus 2 over 7. So LCM is 7, so 72 minus 2, you get 72 over 7 is equals to 10. And that one corresponds to what we have as 10 there. So uh, our answer is correct. That's how we can be able to get to have that with us. So that is how we solve the simultaneous equation using the 
elimination method Good. Let's have a, a third example. Let's have a third example so that you can be able to get a clear picture on how we solve the simultaneous equation. So I have this 2x minus 3y. Minus 3y is equal to 5 and uh, minus x plus 2y is equal to minus 3. Now, we need to solve this simultaneous equation using the uh, elimination method. So, the first thing here we do, we decide. What do you want us to eliminate? Is it x or y? So we can go for x. So if you have to eliminate x here, uh, you can see that we have two x here, we have one x here. Now we have to make them to be equal to one another so that we can go to, uh, to eliminate the same. So the first equation here, I multiply by one so that I don't change anything. The second one here, I multiply by two everything so that this one can be two. So I'm going to have uh, 2x minus 3y is equal to 5. Then 2 times x minus 2x. Uh, 2 times 2 plus 4y. And then 2 times minus 3 gets minus 6. So uh, I have 2x and minus 2x. These signs are different. This is plus, this is minus. Whenever signs are different, we add the two equations so that you can have minus uh, 2x plus minus 2x go to be 2x minus 2x get 0 and then yeah we have eliminated our x then you have to this y minus 3y plus 4y same as 4y minus 3 you get y is equals to 5 plus minus 6 you get minus 1 so our y is minus 1. So when you get our y is minus 1, we now use one of the equations like the first one, uh, 2x uh, minus 3y is equal to 5. We replace with the x, y as minus 1. So 2x minus 3 minus 1 is equal to 5. So 2x minus 3 times minus 1, you get plus 3, is equal to 5, and then 2x will be 5. Uh, take plus 3 on the other side, so you may have 3, so 2x equals to 2, and then x, you divide both sides by 2, you get 1. So our uh, x is uh, 1, y is minus 1, and you can be able to check whether uh, your answer is making sense. By replacing in one of the equations, like now, you can have the equation 2 minus x plus 2y is equal to minus 3. Let's see whether it's going to give us the same. Minus x, x is 1. So minus x is minus 1 plus 2, y is minus 1. So minus 1, 2 times minus 1 is minus 2. So minus 1, minus 2, that one is minus 3, which correspond to what we have there. Can be able to get that uh, uh, working is correct. So generally, that's how we do uh, our that's how we solve simultaneous equation using the elimination method. A very simple one. You just need to remember this that whenever signs are the same like you have minus minus at the or plus at the plus then we usually subtract the two equation but when we have 
the signs being different. That is plus, minus, or minus price. Like in our case here, we have minus 2 and plus 2. The signs are different. We add the two equation to get rid of uh, what you want to eliminate. So when you put that one in mind, then you're okay. You're good to go. Another thing is that uh, whenever you finish doing the simultaneous equation, make sure that uh, you, 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 you check whether the answers are alight by replacing them in the equation to see whether they're going to give you the values that you have there. Otherwise, that is going to be uh, our end of uh, that session um, grant that uh, you have taken your time to watch the video. Uh, just I would like to request you to subscribe to this channel and then uh, things shall be well. Otherwise, uh, have a good time. Uh, enjoy math. Math is sweet. Thank you.